Hey, what's up, guys? It's Logic here. I'm actually gonna talk to you guys about a crazy song that I made collaborating with people on the internet from all over the world that I never even met, from North America, South America, Western Europe, Eastern Europe, Africa, and even Australia. What about Asia? Shut up, Joe. Anyway, I say all this to say, I'm gonna play you guys this song, and I'm also gonna play you the music video that we made for it as well. But before we get into that, I'm gonna tell you how I did it, because I've never done anything like this before. Are we recording? We are working on a song for a project together. With everybody in the world. Do a song with logic, and I'm like, no, 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 that can't be, that can't be real. It's not a competition. It's a collaboration. I contributed baritone sax, clarinet, and horn lines. <laughs> they were amazing. As soon as I heard them, I instantly downloaded them and integrated them into our track. Wow, that's so crazy. I have never really handed over this much creativity to someone else. That's not even one person, it's like a plethora of people. The plan is to bring them to LA. For the video? Yes, but they won't know that. Surprise! We're all gonna shoot a music video today. Oh, Are you serious? All these different people from all over the world coming together, not saying, hey world, look at me and look what I did, but like, what can we all make together? Yo, my heart, my heart's kinda like, Racing a little bit. <laughs> a mark. Meow. B mark. A B. When Joe first came to me about this project, I was already just a big fan of Joe, and it was somebody that I wanted to meet and work with, and I knew a little bit about Hit Record already. Hit Record is, it's my passion project. It's something I started a long time ago with my brother. It's different than other online creative communities because it's not just people posting things that they've made on their own. It's people from all over the world making things together, collaborating. This will be the first time that we've ever done a collaboration led by a number one selling platinum artist like Logic. So he talks to me and he explains, you're going to create a song that you're going to start and then you're going to let it go. You're going to have people from all over the world who are going to contribute and collectively we are going to make a song unlike any other song you've ever created and then shoot a music video for it. And I thought it was a really awesome shit. Hold on, sorry, I'm trying to think of the word. It's a very simple word, I'm up. Idea? No, mm. not obstacle. Concept? No, almost, it challenge. might be with a C. Challenge! <laughs> oh, you wouldn't think I rap. I thought it would be an amazing challenge. <laughs> and so I brought him out on tour to the Madison Square Garden show. <laughs> where we announced to the world that we were working on this amazing project together. We talked a lot about, okay, so what's the song about? The first thing that comes to mind when you come up with as far as song concepts and doing what you love, everybody that would be a part of this is doing what they love and are being encouraged to do what you love. It's Bullshit. So do what you love in life, whether it's acting or music or loving someone, or whatever the case may be, you can be a superstar in your own realm. Do what you love and don't let others tell you that you can't. Because you know, for those who, who don't know, like I came from Section 8 household, welfare, food stamps, like domestic violence in the house, w witnessing crazy things that I had to overcome. But through it all, I would find that escape in the positivity that is my heart. Music saved my life, you know? What's up, guys? What up, bro? How you doing? I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. Me and my guys, Six and Bobby, we got together and started the song. As me and Joe were, were talking about the concept of the song, we just kept talking about doing what we love and what we love. While we were in, isn't it kind of crazy how organic it came up? And that's why I was like, hey, I kind of want a slight James Brown vibe on the drums. Yeah, yeah. Is that like 120? Yeah. No. Is that James Brown too? So. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Thinking about doing what you love when you played that piano? No, it wasn't like uh, thinking about doing what you love as I'm playing these chords. Uh -huh. Like, I'll do that when writing. This is more like vibe. This is for the people who don't give a shit about what the song is about. <laughs> because right. there's so many people who listen to music 
and they don't really listen to the even really listen to the lyrics. Sure. You know what I mean? And sure. they kind of know the hook a little bit, but it's, it just makes them do this. So yeah. I'm just trying to make them do this. I am going through to my notes so that I can write down whatever it is I'm about to rap. But first, I go with the flow. Yeah, living it in the sun down with the bro. Uh. To jump to come back with the throat pack. On the sun that got down with the dun dad. Living to get the bond down when the. Uh. What I'm doing right now is finding syllables in, in a rhythm and treating my voice as an instrument that rides with it. Well, from the young to the old, from the rich to the old, from the rhyme and the soul, from the dime and the bow. From the young to the old with the rhyme and the soul, from the young to the old to the next episode, I've been from the. From the young to the old, we live by the cold, do what you love in life unless you got you. Unless you know it. From the young to the old, we live by the cold, do what you love unless you got you, got you. From the young to the old, we live by the cold, do what you love in life unless I didn't get you. Man, it's like a puzzle, you know, you gotta. <laughs> annoying. <laughs> this is frustrating. From the young to the old, we live by the cold, do what you love in life unless the thing. Yeah, there it is. Thing, got you, yeah. Hey, from the young to the old, we live by the cold, do what you love in. Almost, wait, shit. Young to the old, we cold, do what you love in life, and that's the thing got you running from the popo. There it is, hey. <laughs> All right, can you hit that, and then we'll record it. Woo, I did to the game like a fiend like, uh. Did to the game like a fiend like, uh. I do what you love, do what you love, do what you love, do what you love, come now, do it now, uh. Do what you love, do what you love, do what you love, do what you love, come now, do it now. And it was funny watching Joe watch me work because Joe's like, this is happening way too fast. What we need to do right now yes. is shoot the challenges. You gotta stop. Then I'm like, shut the up. The hard part was stopping at the beginning. Like at the very beginning. I mean, it was like more so of an idea than a song. And it was like, now it's time to take this and give it to a world of people that you don't know, have never met. And, uh, having no idea how this could turn out and sound. And right there, I knew that I was in for something that I'd never experienced before. Hey, what's up, guys? This is Logic, and I have a challenge for all you musicians out there. We're working on this song, which is called Do What You Love. All of this is gonna be filmed and turned into a special for YouTube Originals. We are looking for horn section, guitar, sick bass, a wicked bass line, like flea, and whatever else you guys can think of that I'm not thinking of. Like, like, like. Oh. When I saw Logic's project, I decided to contribute an acoustic guitar. I thought I could add some glockenspiel to the Do What You Love track. Do what you love, do what you love, do what you love, do what you love, come now, do it now. I really wanted to imitate the line, do what you love. <gasps> do what you love, do what you love, do what you love, do what you love, come now, do it now. Most of these people like to be like, plan to be happy, let them know right. Uh, running around without a dream like, uh, dripping my money without a dream like, woo. When Bobby put out the challenge, lots of people contributed, but when it really started to get interesting for me is when people started building off of one another. It's in that remixing that people really started to collaborate. I had started work on the, the project and then Kelly had released her horns. I have contributed baritone sax, clarinet, and horn lines. <laughs> they were amazing. As soon as I heard them, I instantly downloaded them and integrated them into our track. <laughs> Boxing You killed it. Thank you guys for including me in your remix because it's badass. I'm not good enough to do the funk style. So I decided to take Logic Track into a, a completely unique style by composing an orchestral piece. I knew that I wanted to contribute, but I don't know how to play the piano or any instrument for that matter. And music production stuff is very expensive. So I've been using an app that's only $5. When I heard Joshua's piano part, I actually thought he was somewhat classically trained. So that's why I used his part in my orchestral version. With everybody building off of each other, what naturally emerged was these three sort of different versions. There was a funkier version, a more orchestral version, and then there was an electronic version. Yeah. Um, we are at United Studios in downtown, well, near, well, Hollywood, what is this? Hollywood. Yeah, Hollywood. <laughs> so 
people have been contributing to this project now for about four weeks, and uh, this is gonna be the first time that Bobby hears all these different versions that people have put together. Based off all the information I have and what Joe's told me, I'm about to be given a nice onslaught of variation musically. Hopefully we'll come away from today with a solid finished instrumental track that then we can keep building off from there. Last time we got together was on tour. That's the last time I saw you, huh? I know. Damn. And we've both been running around, so we haven't really talked about this. I think people really came through. People all over the world played all this music. I think Bobby's gonna be really inspired by it. All right, this is gonna sound really stupid, but I'm just using this as a good metaphor. I almost feel like, like I'm like a king. And like everyone is bringing me all these things that I can like, you know, do whatever I want with, which is like so amazing. I mean, in other words, like I'm being spoiled musically. Here's what I don't want to have happen. I don't want to like play this music that people have been making and have Bobby go, okay, cool. That's the one thing that I guess would be a little nerve wracking because I'm like, oh, what if it's a whole session of a bunch of stuff that I wouldn't use? This collaborative process that, that we've honed over the years on Hit Record is a real baby of mine. And uh, today, we're putting it to the test kind of more than we ever have before. What naturally emerged from the community is sort of three different versions. Got it. One of them is based on more specifically what you asked for. Yep. And then two of them are kind of other directions that people kind of totally. took it in. 100%. And, you know, someone did this and someone else was like, oh, I like that, let me jump on it, and kind of these other things emerged. Got it. So what I think would be a cool place to start is to just play you these three versions. Yep. Then we've got them all stemmed out and you can start mixing and matching and putting together what you want. Beautiful. Is it ready? The funk idea first, right? Yeah. Who arranged this? The main producers of that version yeah. are a couple. Wow. They go by Fox and Mew. They wow. actually met collaborating online, and now they're married. I'm Fox. I'm Mew. This is Fat Mew. We're Fox and Mew. For years, we had to do the long distance thing across oceans, and I think it was really music that kept us together. Absolutely. Doing what you love for me is doing what exists in your heart, regardless of what obstacles may be in front of you. We had many reasons not to do what we loved. He lived in a different country. We, we had all of these things that were telling us not to make music. And we made music anyways. Uh, can I hear the next one, Bob? Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> That piano is a kid on a phone, on a $5 app. No way. Yeah, he doesn't know how to play the piano. <laughs> Are you serious? Yeah. That, those chords get in your head. Yeah. Those chords have been stuck in my head. That's insane. And then Charlie Armour started the orchestral version. Love it. I'm Charlie Armour. I compose music for indie film and indie video games. Music is my medicine that helps me get through things like this word, depression. I have leukodystrophy, which means I, I have limited movement in both my hands and my legs. Jodie, my sister, had a the same condition and she didn't make it, so she passed away from the condition. So I had the chance of living. It's like a miracle, I suppose. I've, since then, I've always pushed myself. You know, I'm always determined 
do what I can, you know, nothing, there was no barriers with me. I'd love to hear the next one. So that version was started by Paper Aviator. Hi, I'm Brandon. I play piano, guitar, accordion, ukulele, violin, and I'm not very good at making pop. So I went with something that I knew I could make fairly well. I made a chip tune instrumental. I was a bit hesitant of learning styles, but it's been gaining some support. A lot of people seem to like it, so I'm excited to see where it goes. So what do you think? Um... Damn. There's a lot of stuff that people sent. And that, to me, was crazy because I didn't just have a vibe that I created. No, man, you had people that were like, oh, you're gonna do that? Oh, that's cool, that's so cute. That's really cute, I'm gonna do this. Uh, that's great. I already hear from all three things that I would wanna use. Do we have the original as well? The original demo? Yeah, we should have that okay, somewhere. Good. You wanna play that? Okay. I already know, like I'm gonna start with the break, I'm gonna start with simplicity, mm -hmm. and then like build it and build it. So me, I'm, I'm not listening to any of the songs, including my own first version, as a whole. I'm not going, this is what the song is. I'm only listening to elements, so. You're shopping um, in the supermarket. 100%, yeah, <laughs> so I'm in the produce right now, you know what I'm saying, dog? <laughs> Trying to get that cabbage. <laughs> so what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna go in and do it like I would do it. Perfect, man, that's what okay. we want. Cool, can I hear the original? Not one to jump the gun just for fun, but we live in the era where the people on the run. Take everything and put it up. Do what you love and life unless the thing that you run up in the popo. Can you take me to that part where it's like dun 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 dun? It seemed like oh in the first one. Most of these people ain't what it seem like. Tend to be happy now they don't seem right. And then you can mute this too. Dripping my money, cut it the green light. Woo! the game like a feel like. Where's the horn for that? That horn, that horn, that horn. Build it and build it up with the original drums. Build it and build it. My vocal. You run up in the popo. I think I like it that way. What is this bass here too, though? Wow, that's so crazy. Addicted to the game like a fiend, like addicted to the game, like like like. Can you play me the second version, please? What do you think about that? Because I really like the piano. I'm definitely gonna say grab that. Yeah. yeah. Okay. All right. So first, let's put the piano where. Do what you love. Do what you love. Like, like, uh, do what you love. Do what you love. Do what you love. Do what you love. Come now, do it now. Uh. Was there other horn sections in the funk? I'm thinking about energy. Beautiful. Keep my drums. That part there would be fun to just smack you in the face with the horns. You're already mixing the orchestral and the funk. Can I hear the rest of the second version? This is where I wrote Thriller, right here. Let me hear these two together. Keep everything. Bob, can I hear the third version, please? Take the four to floor. Is, is there bass in that as well? Let me hear this section. But we should take the drums out. Will these uh, clash with those? Probably, right? I don't know. You can pretty much mute everything. Everything. I'm not trying to sound any type of way. I don't know how much I I vibe with the EDM part of it. While listening to those elements, like it's really dope, but it, it will completely pull you from the vibe. For the most part, I think the driving force of this. Um, is is the first and the second because of how musical they are. So I think for now I'm gonna stick with the two. Okay, uh, may I hear it from the top with that that arrangement really quick? I'm not listening to any of the songs as a whole. I'm only listening to elements. Only only elements. Builders.
How long is that, Bobby? Right there. Right at three minutes. <laughs> Done. So we should figure out who all we have now in this version that you've arrived at. Beautiful. Okay, and you want me to just go down the list here? Yeah, sure. Guitar chords from Jehan Poor. So that's first, and then woodwinds from Ernie. So you got the piano part. You don't want to make him learn how to play the piano for real? We could tell him, yeah, learn it or play it, and that'd be like fun and all, but I almost think it's doper to be like, anyone can make music, you have no excuse. You have a phone, you have an instrument. Great. And then that would be the horn player. Pop pot, that's the bass we're using. Jonah Kaler, the claps. Yeah. Brazilian drums with the snare. And then we have the Glock part, tender lock. We have a guitar part, Aitua. Then we got another high guitar part, Mickey P. Cool. And then we have Charlie's orchestral string part. Once I went through all those stems from all the different sounds and flavors, we had a real solid bass. I always think about how to just take things and push it and have fun with it. So that's when I flipped it on its head and was like, yo, let's just make some crazy trap shit. I want this to be like bohemian cracksity like shit. Yo, you trying to up with some trap shit? Yeah. Okay, perfect. Would you like any of these sounds? You know, whether it's a piano what or- What is that like string, like stabs? The Morricone shit? Is that Charlie Armour? Yeah, that shit's hard. This is where I shut up for a little bit and just let him do his thing. <laughs> Yo, this is hard. It's Money, 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 money. When we see the dunny, dunny, I get in it, in it, run it, ain't it funny? Then it send it, bump, bump. Ooh. So money, doing what you love is a very positive, fun, ener energetic song, but I wanted to have highs and lows. So perhaps even on this verse here, it could be like, yeah, you, you can do what you love, but it can come at a cost. For example, a lot of people think like they have to be a superstar, they have to be this, and it's like, why? Ask you, why do you want to be a superstar? For money? For fame? Well, I'll tell you this, I've had all the money in the world and been depressed. I've been in the middle of tours on stage having anxiety and panic attacks inside and no one even realizes it. And I wish I was not in front of 20,000 people. So why would I put myself in a position to be in front of 20,000 people and be hurting inside and they don't even realize it because at the end of the day, I still love it more than anything. So the second verse for me could be a bit more somber saying like, no matter what, Still do what you love, but ask yourself, why are you doing it? Can't do it, I love. No, I can't do it, I love. Living like I never had it. Mama was an addict. Listen to the static in the streets. Then I added to the beats. Money made the world go round. Money make your girl go down like, uh. We made the track. Said, OK, cool. This is our base. I left spaces open for our next challenge, which was going to be to all the vocalists out there. We are calling out everyone who can sing, rap, honestly anything, right? It really doesn't matter. Whatever you want to do, whatever you want to add, have a blast, have fun, submit it, and, and we'll, we'll mess with it. Do what you love, 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 come now, do it now. Oh, darling, can't you see? This is who you're meant to you love is not like loving. Do what you love and live the thing you love. originally submitted to the instrumental challenge. But I wanted to sing. So we also submitted to the vocal challenges. People judge and people hate. People seek to silence and to satiate. I have been singing professionally for seven years, and I've been singing in the shower since I was uh, four. I was very nervous when I submitted my piece because I listened to everyone else's pieces. And I was like, wow, everything's like better than me. And I was like, I didn't even want to submit, but then I just thought, something told me that I should just do it anyway. I got a mind full of doubt and a heart full of gold. Has doing what I love in my life been easy? No. <laughs> I am a behavior analyst by trade, and for the longest time, I didn't sing. I think hit record is what ultimately gave me the courage to continue to sing. Gotta find a way. I have no idea what this session is gonna bring. I don't know what he's gonna do, like if it inspires him to all of a sudden take the song in a whole new direction. Last time, we got to piece everything together using the instrumental parts from all the various musicians. And now he's gonna play me some crazy vocals and I have high expectations. 
When we were playing him all the different instrumental tracks, he's listening to lots of things at once. But now we're just gonna be playing one person at a time and saying like, do you like what this person did? Should it go on the track, yay or nay? After Bobby's picked all the different vocalists that are going in the song today, we're gonna get on a big like video conference call to talk to all the different people who contributed their instrumentation, all the different people who contributed their vocals, and uh, he's gonna invite them to LA. And he's gonna tell them that he's inviting them to LA just to hear the finished song. What they don't know is he's actually inviting them to LA to be in the music video. Yeah, recording? Good, all right. Okay, so today's kind of about vocals. Yep. Uh, some of them are background vocals, people singing harmonies and stuff. Some of them are people singing lead. Yep. And some of them are raps. Dope. And then, of course, you can start placing them wherever you want to place them and start, you know, making the song whatever you want it to be. Okay, sounds good. Just understand that I'd love to use it all, but the song would be like nine minutes. Yeah. So now I got to figure out who's making the team. Is it ready? Yeah. All right, we got Jehan. That's the uh, Swiss gal. Beautiful. This is her? That's her. From Switzerland. Yeah, she doesn't sound Swiss exactly, does she? No, she's, she's killing it. So let's remember that one, and then let's hear what's next, please. Fox and Mew. Backgrounds. Their instrumental contribution didn't end up yeah, in this yeah. version, so this is sort of another shot for them. Oh, it's the, yeah, it's the couple again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Amazing. Her voice is dope. Mm. It's so cool. It's like indie meets like. 5% Macy Gray in there. Like, <laughs> let's, let's like hear the next one. Okay, Sorry, so, I know I'm going through them, but I yeah, good. make sure I hear so this it. is um, Chanelle Willie. She's Irish. Most of these people only worry about the brain light. Most of these people ain't what they say like. Then they be happy that they don't feel right. Running around without a dream light. Trying for my money, cause it's been like. I think it's been like, 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 like. Do what you love, do what you love, do what you love, do what you love. Come now, do it now. Do what you love, do what you love, do what you love, do what you love. Come now, do it now. That was really dope. Uh, next one. Okay, well now we have Holubi. 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 From Argentina. Yo, that shit is crazy. What's that? That and. <laughs> that shit is so. F weird and eclectic and that's a good thing yeah he said we've been asking everybody to like record themselves he he said he didn't want to due to the psychedelics and also personal shame <laughs> <laughs> this guy's great that's why i'm not looking you at the camera the camera is trying to get <laughs> let's hear what's next please uh vison I got a mind full of doubt wow. and a heart full of gold. Wow. Yo, that shit's crazy. I'm trying to push to the top. The thought of heaven is so. Why the f boys? But you gotta keep working, keep pushing, and find a place to start. 100% gonna use that. That shit's crazy. Who is he? That? That guy? <laughs> He's a kid! I'm from Zambia. He sounds like that? Lives in the UK. I can't believe it. How old is he? I'm 18 years old. I'm studying sustainable energy engineering because it's what my parents wanted me to do. I've never told my parents that I love singing. I was asking my dad, hey dad, what do you think about a career in music? And literally, he just started laughing. He's like, you're not gonna do that. When my dad told me I couldn't pursue music, it was really painful. I believe that if I tell my dad that I have that opportunity to be in a song with someone who is just an icon in the music industry, maybe my dad would be supportive of me pursuing music. Trade ends up next. From Canada. Wow. I've got to find a way back to the things I love because I'm giving up more and more every day. All right, let me hear homeboy real quick. 
I got a mind full of doubt. So right after that, if you could put her her vocal. I got a mind full of doubt and a heart full of gold. Damn, that shit is crazy, dog. I'm push to the top, the thought of heaven is so. All right, let's go. What's next? Next up, the rappers. Poeticon. I do what I do, I do it for you, and if you and me with the truth, and you probably want me to follow that. I love what I say, and live with the day. Meryl can swing away, because I'm never afraid of falling back. I do what I love, do what I love, give what I love, share what I love, won't stop giving back. I'm giving you love, feeling you love. If you and love is enough, then you probably want to continue that. I do feel it. Kids got heart, but I don't know. All right, here's uh, Sean Elliott. Yeah, you snapped. Who's next? Tiago. I remember Q-tips at the push the norm. I remember MC Lucius up in the song. Remember every second of effort into my efforts. Now I'm ready for detonation like a nuclear bomb. So what's up? Anytime, any place, I'm a day. Got something to say to come get me. Shit, I with the hate. I'm just trying to celebrate, bitch. I'ma make it rain up a day. Beautiful. Um, just being honest. Yeah. The, all the raps are really dope, but because I'm doing my thing, not to yep. sound any type of way, but I know how to f like project. Mm -hmm. I need someone who's gonna project. I don't know if I'm gonna put a rapper on it. Well, there's one more you haven't heard yet. Should we put it on? Yeah, for sure. Are ya? Hey. hey. Running up for the pivot, and then I just gotta make it just jump broke. You never miss work, jam with diligence, trying to pay the dividends. And if I never do it, at least I pursue the passion that brought me moments of magic. But this is just everlasting, us and I on the song with the pressure. Boy, you dream of this moment of all along from the bottom of my heart. Things are got up above, because he gave me the guidance to do what I love. Yeah, that's it. Damn. He snaps. Yeah, what is it about him that made you know? Honestly, it's just like delivery, flow, punchline confidence dog like when he's rapping like he's on that shit and that's that's what i love about it he sounds like you bro <laughs> nice. growing up i had always felt uncomfortable i was extremely overweight as a kid and it affected me in a way where i didn't really have an outlet and i just feel horrible about myself music specifically through hip-hop is why i've overcome a lot of obstacles even though i've overcome a lot of adversity there's still a lot more that i'm dealing with now and there are still a lot of people who say that I'm not worthy and I don't fit the image of hip hop as being someone who's Middle Eastern in descent. It's something that has affected me and it kind of pushes you to a point to question yourself. So let's go down the list and this is the grand total of everybody that's on the track. Nice. For the rap feature we have Arya. With the background vocals we got Lamar Jones. Vison. Oh yeah, he snapped. Fox and Mew. Ruby. Traded. Campaign, Jehan, Denise. Beautiful. It's gonna be crazy. It's gonna be, mm, it's gonna snap, you know what I'm saying? Zim. Okay, so the team's gathering, not just these vocalists, but also the people who played all the instruments. We can tell them they're coming to LA and they made it on the song. It's gonna be a big conference call party, yeah. Oh, it's a giant conference call? Yeah, 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 yeah. That's amazing. And they're gonna bring the computer in in a second once everybody's on. Incredible. Yeah. That's the other thing. <laughs> Are we gonna be like together or are you gonna go and then I'll sit and pop in like, what's up, my Yeah, yeah, we'll start with me and then you sit in. I'm kind of nervous. <laughs> I know, me too. Hey. Hello. You guys, uh, they're ready, okay? All right. Let's try it. Yo, my heart, my heart's kind of like racing a little bit. I'm, no, I'm excited. <laughs> I can... This dude plays arenas. <laughs> <laughs> Hello. Yo. Hey. What's up, everybody? <laughs> How you guys doing? <clears throat> Someone else wants to come sit down, though. Hold on. Hey, what's up? Oh, what's up? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. <laughs> no way. <laughs> How's it going? <laughs> Yo, my man is, is in the car right now. Cam, are you driving? 
I'm almost home. I'm almost home. Yeah. <laughs> so, there's so many of you guys. I would love to talk to you all in person <laughs> for you guys to fly out to LA and listen to the song that we've created all together. Hell yeah. No, I cannot believe this is happening. <laughs> oh my God. That's freaking crazy. <laughs> And I want to thank everybody in the community. Like, this is crazy. I'm blessed enough to be surrounded by, you know, some of the greatest musicians in the world, but they still come up short to you guys. Whoa. <laughs> thank you. And wait till you hear, like, the final. It's wild. What he's been cooking up today, like, putting all of you guys together, it sounds like a really cool song. I can't wait for you guys to hear it. This is crazy. This is crazy. <laughs> this is a dream come true. It's mind-blowing to me. We appreciate you, and uh, it's going to be a blast. Hell yeah. We're All right, peace. <laughs> See you later. Thank you so much. <laughs> Let me give the computer back. <laughs> wow, that was so cool. Yo. That was perfect. Oh, wow. That's a cool group of people, man. They were also very, like, respectful and, like, listening. And... Yeah, yeah, yeah. So then uh, next time I see you, we'll be at this shoot. That's All right. wild. All right. Cut to. <laughs> I haven't slept tonight, but I'm thinking of taxi with the Heathrow Airport. I had two hours of sleep. Let's go to LA. Go to LA. This is LA. I'm bouncing from Texas, and I'm bringing my thing. Mom, what are you putting makeup on for? I guess you guys are friends, Mom. I am excited to be everyone. I'm really nervous. I don't know what to expect. Fresh pair of socks and underwear every day, man. About to leave. I just forgot my phone charger. It's, a, it's only a couple of days, he'll be fine. To the airport. So this is the first time I'm traveling as somebody's wife. Go ahead and listen to this. Get on a plane. I'm already messing the cat. It's the last time I'll see snow. See you soon. Freaking hot weather and palm trees. I'm here. I'm really jet like I'll be here. And I'm starving. Just looking for my bag. I'm just trying to figure out if this is real. I'm finally here. Hey. I'm going in. Oh. Oh. I can't believe I'm meeting Logic tomorrow. I saw everyone else, and everyone else was like me, was like in the dark, as like, what's gonna happen? Of course, I get a little <laughs> nervous thinking about it. I'm really excited and scared. I can't wait to hear the final product. Who's nervous? Raise a hand. It is insane. Is it not so out of your mind ridiculous that doing what you love brought so many people from so many different walks of life? Yeah, yeah it's just crazy. Absolutely not. Surprise! <laughs> <laughs> Going. It's incredible to see all these people and meet them in person. Nice to meet you, dude. It's a bunch of visionaries coming together from all over the world. You know, just like seeing different people process it. Bro. What's up, Bring it in, bro. It's funny. Some people taking it in, other people filming that shit. And then me and Joe just kind of being in the middle of it. Like, I can't believe we created this amazing song together. I wish I could do that. Can you do that? Any of you guys? I've never done anything like this, and I'm really excited and super grateful that all of you guys could uh, contribute to this. And, and I hope you guys enjoy it, and I guess I'll just play this. I'm hearing the song for the first time. I still am, like, nervous and um, kind of... Oh, freaking hell. All right, here we go. Whoa. Yeah. Uh, not one to jump the gun to for fun, but we live in an era where the people on the run from the young to the old. We when I heard the uh, final track for the first time, it was like powerful. I'm never connecting with other people. It's great to be other people that are just like me. Through music, we've connected. It feels good. I was overcome with pride. I was looking at people around the room and I was like, we did something outstanding. Living your vocal kicks in. Only you can be. You know, I was 
was just immensely proud of your vocal on that. Music has helped me with a lot. When I was younger, I had dealt with uh, depression. Music gave me that hope and gave me that promise that I can become something no matter what it is. Now I'm here in LA, and this process has given me the reassurance I've been missing. I didn't know which part will be in which section of the song, and listening to the complete thing was amazing. Open that door. You do what you love. I would have never made this song without these people. I stand proudly on top of the mountain shouting, we did this. Basically, I wanted some of you guys to memorize your lyrics just in case we were to re-record, but that's bullshit because we're all going to shoot a music video today. Yeah. Are you serious? Yeah, God, that's crazy. So if you get stage fright, figure it out. You want to show them how calm we are? We're this calm, right? Yeah, that's calm. Yeah, what hand do you shoot with? Yeah. <laughs> we got to mention two people that couldn't be here today, Vison and Dalibi, because of visas and how difficult that can be these days. Maybe like a round of applause. Yeah. Yeah. Hola. Oh my God. <laughs> how you doing? I'm good, how are you? I'm good, I'm just here with my buddy. Hey man, what's going on? Oh my God. Yeah. <laughs> Today, we are filming a music video, and even though you couldn't make it, we would like to film you singing your part live so that we can include it in the music video, and here's everyone. Yeah. <laughs> so, slay, okay. <laughs> We'll just find the grooves together, and then we'll flare it up sometimes. Let's all do this, like, woo, woo, right? <laughs> In the world today, there's a lot of negativity. There's a lot of people competing and getting at each other's throat. We're oh, like a dance show now. Hey. And it just felt really good to see all these people, especially using the internet, not to like one up each other. Yeah. To come together for the purpose of all accomplishing something in collaboration makes me feel optimistic. It's unreal, man. Right now, we're here now. About to shoot, like, about to shoot an actual video. I can't wait. Wow. That's a once in a lifetime opportunity, man. Yeah. What's up? What's up? Let's go. We're too excited to be getting out of the car, damn. Yeah. I'm a bit of a loner, but this has taken me out of my box and it's been great for me. Personally, it's pushed me. I can always tell someone that when I'm old or something like that, I did this. Action! Go ahead. Go ahead. Nice. I hope that above and beyond even the music, they just take away a memory they'll always cherish and, and have. It's not even about the song. It's about all these amazing people from around the world coming together to do what they love and not doing it for money, for fame, but because they're all really coming from the heart. And cut! I've met these incredible people from all over the world. I've told you the story of how this song came together. And now I just think you should stick around and watch this kick-ass music video. Oh, I gotta get up now? You know what's great? Is we should leave this in there. And then it's awkward. All right. And then you play the, you, you play it. Thank you, everybody. Nice. That's amazing. Hey. You bond guest? Oh.
my way. Are you buying? This is the mystery machine, dude. I'm not buying the gas. What, so I'm buying? Yeah. Why am I buying the gas? It's a mystery, but you're gonna buy the gas. All right, let's do it. From the young to the old, we live at the cold. Do what you love and life, unless I think that you're running from the popo. Woo. Not in money in the thing, like, woo. Screaming money in the thing, like, most of these people only worry about the bling, like, uh. Let LeBron worry about the rain, like, uh. Most of these people ain't what it seem like, uh. Trying to be happy, now that don't seem right, uh. Running around without a dream, like, uh. Driven my money, caught it the green, like, woo. Addicted to the game, like a fiend, like, uh. Addicted to the game, like a fiend, like, uh. Addicted to the game, like a fiend, like, uh. Addicted to the game, like, like, uh. Like, uh. You know, beer can? You know, beer can? Beer can? In English? Accent? Beer can. But it sounds like bacon in Jamaican, you know what I'm saying? Beer, <laughs> beer can? <laughs> All right, I'm sorry. So those two are great. If you say rise up lights in, in an American accent, rise up lights, it sounds like you're saying razor blades with an Australian accent. <laughs> rise up lights. <laughs> rise up lights. <laughs> rise up lights. <laughs> oh, shit. Rise up lights. <laughs> Rise up lights. Rise up lights. <laughs> Rise up lights. <laughs> Rise up lights. <laughs> oh shit. Again, my heart.